What is going on YouTube? Vape family, what's going on? How you doing? Welcome to another installment of the Liquid King Chronicles, guys. And of course, I am your host, the Liquid King, your stepmom's favorite vapor. So, as you may know, conventions are a great way to branch out and find new liquids. Um, you'll find the most delicious liquids that you've never even heard of up and coming companies. And the review we're going to be doing today is specifically that genre of, of basically new liquids. And I'm very interested in this line and seeing where this company is going to be going because every single liquid they have is unlike any liquid that you've tried. This one in particular, I'm a New Englander. This sandwich is a staple. That's the name of the liquid as well, is the sandwich. But we're gonna dive right into that right after I basically give you some information on the liquid itself. So the company is called Pinkies Up, as you can obviously see. Pinkies Up's got a super cool little logo, a little, a little guy, a little dude down on the pinky, premium me liquid. Um, had to obviously rock it with the socks, had to match it up. But anyways, um, they've got four liquids in the line. So you've got FAF, which is fancy as not going to cuss anymore because YouTube demonetizes videos for that. Stuck Up, which is um, Apple's peanut butter and some other stuff. And then Cactus Chiller, okay? Which is like a uh, cactus juice, menthol. And then this one is, like I said, the sandwich. So I don't know if you can see that, but the label's beautiful. Very, very, very well done. It is a fluff and nut sandwich with bananas and fresh cut strawberries. Normal stuff on the label, Prop 65 warning, poison control with the poison control number, which is huge, huge on, on bottles. Not for sale to minors, not approved by the FDA, keep away from pets and children. Very, very good to have that on a bottle. Um, this is a zero milligram. I've been actually vaping three milligram for at least the last month in with the Cleto RTA. Um, I've got some irreverence in here, very, very good stuff. But this liquid also comes in zero, 1.53 and six. 30 milliliter bottle, 13 shekels, and then um, 16 mil is 25, all right? So with no further ado, let's dive into the review. I'm gonna let you know basically about the cloud production and overall flavor. This is zero, so we're not gonna obviously go over throat hit, but I did try three milligram at the convention and it's smooth like butter. So um, I've got it loaded up on the hexome. I've got my goon on top. I've got a big fat twisted Clapton on here. We're ready to rock and roll. So let's get into it, shall we? Thank you guys for tuning in. I don't, I don't know what this is. It looks like a 7030 for sure. The bubble moves pretty quickly, so definitely looks like a 7030 VGPG. But it gives excellent, excellent vapor production. Really thick, dense, milky clouds. You're gonna linger around in the room, stay around and hang around for a while. If you're by yourself and you're alone, the clouds will be your buddies. As the flavor, like, it's just unlike any vape I've had. It's got a very prominent peanut butter flavor. As you know, if you guys don't know, if you're not from New England, the two best things growing up as a kid is ice cold, tall glass of coffee milk and a fluff nut, which is obviously peanut butter, um, fluff, if you've never had that, or maybe you guys have had jet puffed, if you're a loser, just kidding. But, um, and, and they did a little twist, they threw some bananas in and some strawberries. I would never eat this type of sandwich, but it, it looks pretty damn good. I mean, I'm sure you guys would chomp that right up. But yeah, when you, I'll tell you what I get, obviously taste is subjective and everybody will taste different, different, um, concentrates in the VG and PG, but this is what I get when I inhale. It 
very, very well blended up front notes of the peanut butter and banana melding together. And as you almost finish, you get like a tart, fresh strawberry. It's not a fake candy strawberry. It's a fresh cut ripe strawberry. Not getting too much of the white bread, but I do get a nice, delicious um, flavor via nostril exhale of that peanut butter and banana. This has had ample time to steep. Um, which, believe it or not, zeros, fresh bottles, fresh liquids, do sometimes have to steep for a little bit. Chuck them in a drawer, pop them under the sink, a week, two weeks, pull them out, shake them up like a Polaroid pitcher, and crack it open, and you should have yourself a nice tasty little vape. Very, 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 very well blended liquid. I'm excited to, to vape the other liquids. Not a huge menthol fan, but for you guys that are, I will eventually um, crack into that cactus chiller. Probably not gonna like it, but I'll still review it. But overall, I would, I would definitely give this a nine. It's a good liquid, it's different. You're gonna like it if you like peanut butter vapes. It's not a harsh, nasty, gross peanut butter. It's reminiscent of Skipper. It's like a sweet, honey-type peanut butter. And those bananas just come in in the background. They're not very prominent, which is good. I don't, I don't, I don't want the fruit and the strawberry to overpower everything. But that peanut butter and banana, just a, just a touch of white bread. But those strawberries come in right at the end. So I think that you guys would like this. Um, if you already own this, please chime in in the comment section about throat hit, chime in in the comment section about your opinion on it. Do you like it? Do you agree or disagree with my assessment on the overall vape review? And um, if you try any of the other flavors, FAF, Stuck Up, and Cactus Chiller, if you like that stuff, feel free to, again, chime in in the comment section. All comments are welcome. Trolls eat shit. I'm vaping this nice and hot too. I've got the hex turned all the way up. And I, I love it. I really love it. So that's pretty much going to do it. There really isn't much to yap about. Um, I'll be doing some tank reviews shortly in, in correlation with juice reviews. I got some new tanks and we'll go over them. But guys, thank you so much. We're almost at 700 subs. It's been a fun four and a half months, I think. So the, the channel is doing pretty well. Always like, thumbs up, subscribe, share the video, post it on Facebook, post it in Facebook groups. Show some love to your boy, okay? Fellow local New Englander, show some love. That's it, guys. Out there in the real, real world, outside of YouTube, always be kind to one another. Please don't be an asshole. And always keep your vape pan strong.